Police are keeping a strong presence in the North Brisbane suburb where yesterday's pre-dawn shooting occurred. They've cordoned off the home of missing man Nigel Perodi, who calls himself Jesse James and who police want to question over the shooting. Police say Perodi is a frequent hitchhiker and they've issued descriptions throughout the country, but so far there have been no confirmed sightings. Perodi is also believed to have good bush survival skills and may be using these to go into hiding. He worked on station properties in the northern parts of Australia and the western parts of Queensland and uh, what else he did from that I don't know. They've also found a note believed to have been written by the gunman. I can confirm a note was found but I'm not going to discuss the contents of it. Perodi doesn't have a gun licence and has a psychiatric record. Meanwhile, the three injured police officers remain in hospital. All are in a stable condition, although one is dangerously ill, one is serious, the other satisfactory. Early yesterday morning, they were showered with 12 bullets from a low-caliber firearm as they sat in their car, considering their response to a neighbourhood dispute. Constable Chanel Cole was shot eight times. Constable Darrell Green and Sergeant Christopher Mulhall were shot twice. Alison Smith, ABC News, Brisbane.